Today, I'm gonna to be opening up two Paldea Evolved Elite Trainer Boxes. Pokemon changed up their ETBs and now include nine packs and an exclusive promo card. This ETB is extremely special because it will feature the Pikachu promo card with the Paldean starters. I'm extremely excited to see this card in person and hopefully we get some insane hits. All right, so here we have it. We got the Paldea Evolved Elite Trainer Box. We're gonna go ahead and get this one open so we can see that promo card. So there is the image of it right on the back. So let's get the sleeve off. That is a really good looking Elite Trainer Box. I really like this one. I know I've talked about it in a couple other episodes, but man, this is just beautiful. So it looks like we got the player's guide here. Let's take out this insert. Let's see, we should have, I think it's nine packs. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven eight nine packs now that's awesome get all the normal accessories let's check out these sleeves too man <laughs> those are really nice sleeves all right and the moment we've all been wait a minute hold on oh wait no i thought it was another promo it's just the just the energies all right here it is the moment we've all been waiting for the pikachu promo in english that is gorgeous i'm actually going to open this one up so we can check out the quality very curious to see if this thing is going to be uh cut well and stuff like that so centering looks really good, actually. Wow, okay. And the back looks really good. So, I mean, typical like promo cuts on the corner, but honestly, it's not bad at all. The centering is just about perfect on this. Gorgeous card, that's insane. All right, let's get this cleaned up and then we're gonna open the nine packs. So I'm gonna put that Pikachu in the back so you guys can see it while we're opening this. That is so nice. So already this feels way better than like opening up a Sword and Shield Elite Trainer box because you only got eight packs and no promo at all in regular sets. You only got the promos in special sets, so that's really cool. There is a promo card for you, and let's get through these. So this is our second or third Paldea Evolved opening so far. Got the Bramblegast, Superior Energy Retrieval, and a Jump Luff Hollow. Really nice looking hollow there. Let's move on to pack number two. Still cannot believe that, I mean, I guess it makes sense that they put that in there because of the Paldean starters, but that is such a nice promo card. Um, the last promo card like that in English was actually in a collection box, but it had Pikachu and the starters of the uh, generation, the Sword and Shield generation. Let's see, we got the Phalanx, we got a Sandy Ghast, and a Gyarados. I love this holo, just for a regular holo. That is a really, really nice card. Wow, no hits yet, but I mean, you can't really be mad when you get that promo uh, guaranteed. You really can. I think that's uh, one reason that they really tried to do that, just to make ETBs feel a little bit better to open. Um, I've never been a fan of collecting or like opening ETBs, really, just because it's not a very good cost-effective way to open packs. Gotharita, got the Faulkner, and a Sableye Hollow. There wasn't ever really a reason to buy more than one ETB, unless there was like two artworks and uh, maybe you want to keep one sealed. That was really the only reason to do that, but now that you get the promo card, this makes it that much better. Hopefully we see some really cool pulls too. I would like to get some pulls here. <laughs> that would be nice. Mystery of us. Got the Litleo Reverse and a Pikachu EX. We actually pulled this in our booster box, but I will definitely take another one. That is insane. Really nice card. Let's go ahead and we'll put that in the back next to the Pikachu. We'll see which ETB is better. We'll do a little head-to-head -head competition since we are opening up two ETBs to see which one wins. Let's see, there is your code card. I don't know if those code cards work just yet. This is a little bit of an opening, depends on when this comes out. But you're welcome to give it a try. Got the Iona Reverse, a Shinx Reverse, and another Gyarados Hollow. I mean, I'll take it. Hopefully you guys like the new uh, lighting on the packs. I think they look a little bit better. Finally got the lighting right. Been trying to get that down. We don't really do like a whole lot of pack openings unless it's like a new set or something like that. Uh, but definitely still wanna make sure that you guys get the best quality. So I think they look pretty good. Let's see, we got the Skip Bloom, we got a Reverse Paldean Whooper, Reverse Quaxly, and a Belly Bolt EX. Man, these EXs are really popping. They look a lot better. That looks good. We'll put that in the back. I think we got three packs left for this ETB. We need something good. We got two EXs, which isn't bad, especially being um, Pikachu, since we got the Pikachu promo to go along with it. See, Friggy backs, no art rares though. Definitely want to see some art rares because that's probably my favorite thing about this set. Azumarill, got the Tinkaton, Sneasel, and a Serral Edge Hollow. For me, I would love to get the Tyranitar art rare or the Magikarp. Those are probably my two favorite cards in the entire set. Uh, definitely some really good trainer cards though. I mean, there are some fantastic uh, trainers in this set. I think it's way better than like Rebel Clash, which was the second set of the Sword and Shield era. Got the Luxio. Pupitar, got the Tyranitar Reverse, got a Sprigatito Reverse, and a Palmot Hollow. Still need some more hits. All right, just like that, we're down to our last pack. So I'm thinking maybe 
We got a good opportunity on this second box to uh, beat this one with two EXs. I haven't really opened up enough how they evolved to get a feel for the pull rates just yet. We'll have to see if it's uh, better than Scarlet and Violet or worse. Um, I think the cards are probably better. I think there's definitely uh, better cards available in this. We've got the Grusha Reverse, got a Dino Reverse, and <laughs> another one. <laughs> and we get three Gyarados Hollows in uh, nine packs. Real quick, we're going to be giving away a Paldea Evolved Elite Trainer Box to one lucky subscriber. To enter, all you have to do is like this video, subscribe to our channel with notifications on, and comment down below your favorite pull from today's episode. All right, back to the video. All right, we reset the backs there, and we're going to probably uh, open this one up a little bit faster. All right, let's take that sleeve off. There's that player guide. All right, let's get to that. Uh, promo in the packs here got our nine packs on this side we'll probably open up that pikachu promo again just to see uh the quality control again um and looking at it, it looks pretty good let's open it up all right let's check this out again this one actually looks like so this one looks like the corners are actually better the centering's a little off on this one though but still for promos, this is really, really good for English quality control. I'll definitely take it. All right, we're gonna get everything cleaned up here. Promo goes in the back. Let's scooch that over so it's not glaring at us so much. There we go. All right, so I'd say the uh, the bar is probably set pretty low for this ETB. Um, two EX is in the last one, not too bad, but again, it just uh, makes it a whole lot better when you get that promo just guaranteed. So here we go, ETB number two. Gotta have some better luck, I'm thinking. But man, uh, that Pikachu EX is really nice. Iono got the Ice Q and a Garganacle Hollow. It's a lot of like <laughs> tough to pronounce Pokemon, honestly, in uh, this new Scarlet and Violet expansion. Tons of them. All right, there is your code card. Again, I don't know if those are going to work just yet, but uh, if they don't, just save them for when they do work. Let's see what we got. Floor Gato. We got the Tinkatuff, Mistrevus. Got the Flamigo um, United Wings. That's actually a really cool ability there. And then the Bax Caliber, also a really good playable card. Yeah, that Flamigo card is actually insanely good for the uh, United Wings deck. Really interesting play style, kind of like the old Night March or uh, what was the one in the last one? I can't remember. Mad Party, that's right. There is the uh, Night March and I think Lost March, then Mad Party, all very similar mechanics. All right. We have not pulled an Art Rare yet. We've got a Pupitar. And a boss's orders, hollow rare. Okay. All right. We definitely need some hits. And we're probably going to do a uh, mass opening of Paldea Evolve relatively soon. That way we can get an idea of kind of what the pull rates are like. We'll have to see. Go over there. Pack. Nobody wants you anymore. All right. Let's get it. Let's get some big hits. Magikarp. Come on, please. Would love to see that art rare. Uh, got the, you know, plenty of copies of the Japanese one. I absolutely love it. Slacking and an Obama Snow Hollow. Okay. Well, I thought the bar was low. But I guess when it's just nine packs, you just never know. I mean, you might get something really crazy or you might just get nothing. You might just get nothing. Here's that code card. Sorry about that. The face cam died. Uh, <laughs> kind of recording this quickly because this stuff just came in. So I wanted to get a quick video out on these Elite Trainer boxes. Got the Delivery Drone. Got the Prime Ape. Man, we need something. All right, Veluza Hollow. Just four packs left of this ETB and we have not hit anything yet. Let's see. That pack opened interestingly. All right, there's your code card. Let's flip these around. We got to get something. Got to get something in this. Just a one big hit would be nice. Let's see. What do we got? We got the Rukadi Reverse, Magnemite Reverse. Oh, there we go. We got a full art. Chen Pao EX. Have not seen this card at all in Japanese or anything. I will definitely take that. And again, I'm thinking Paldea Evolve quality control is better. Just a little bit off center, but I will definitely take that. That's insane. All right, let's put that one in the back next to Pikachu. So, I mean, I would say that's probably close to on par with two regular EXs, uh, especially with the playability of that card. That's one of the most playable cards in the entire set. Um, really, really good card. The Chen Pao EX Full Art. It looks really light, too. Like, it's not super dark blue or anything. All right, we got the Reverse Pikachu. That's actually pretty good. And a Chi Yu EX. Okay, all right, we're heating up a little bit. All right, so two of the Ancient Legendary EXs. All right, two more packs. Let's see if we can just uh, make it even better here. Still not a single Art Rare. I think the Art Rares are actually pretty tough to pull now. I think from the Booster Box, we only got two Art Rares, which was, I think, similar to Scarlet and Violet, but there might've been a Booster Box in Scarlet and Violet that I may have gotten three but two is um, pretty low for an entire booster box. Tinka Tough and an Oracorio Hollow. All right, let's see some last pack magic out of the Quaquavel uh, art pack here. Let's see it. There are actually, what, five different 
pack arts for this set. That's pretty cool. The three starters and I think two of the ancient legendaries. All right, last pack magic. Let's see if we can make it happen. Oh, that's so cool. Just the artwork on that regular card. Practice Studio, Florigato. Give me an art rare. We got the Raichu in reverse. Nice. All right, Sableye, and I don't think we got anything. Oh man, we got another Jump Love Hollow. All right, that's it for today's episode. The second ETB probably took the lead there, but honestly, it's so much more fun to open up ETBs now that you get that guaranteed insane promo. Thanks so much for watching. If you do want to help support the channel, you can do your Pokemon card shopping at pokecollect.com. We still have some Paldea Evolved products available if you haven't ordered any already. You can get some insane deals while also helping out the channel, so it's a win-win. All right, and with that, we'll see you next time.